Well, did someone say reindeer? If so, we've got you covered. If you can believe it, we are halfway through the month of December and countdown until the day that Christmas is here. Behind the big man, Santa himself, there's nothing quite as characteristic of the holiday like his reindeer. Our hawk camera spent the afternoon at a reindeer farm in Reardon. He's going to help us expand our knowledge about Santa's hooved helpers. When you ask the question, my husband thought that reindeer would be fun and easy. Did you ever think you'd be caring for a herd of reindeer? They're not easy. You get the quick answer. Never in my wildest dreams. <laughs> but 20 years into it, yes, I do love it. And they're like a dog. I mean, they're like a giant dog. That love means a lot at Reindeer Express in Reardon, where reindeer run the show. And this is their time to shine. Seeing the excitement on people's faces and especially older people, if it's their first time realizing that they're real and not a storybook character. They don't take visitors. Their reindeer come to you, and most of them are already out for the season. But the babies stay close. They've got a bit of learning still to do before they head out for the Christmas crowds. Their antlers aren't quite as big as their parents, but they've still got them. The babies um, start growing antler within 30 days of being born. So what else do these creatures have going for them? Their hair has air inside of it, so it acts like an insulator and helps them float in water, helps keep them warm. And did you know? The bulls lose their antlers about December and the females between February and March. Follow that line of logic and here's what you get. It's the females that are pulling Santa's sleigh <laughs> and the boys are at home resting. <laughs> But on this farm, the antlers aren't left laying around. We lose them every year, so we don't pull them off. <laughs> they fall off like a loose tooth. They get repurposed into something as equally Christmassy. They turn those antlers into these ornaments. I look for character. It takes some sign, some painting, some polishing, but the end result little spikes. It's a double dose of Christmas, a double dose of reindeer for your tree from right here in eastern Washington. I'm Hawk Hammer, KSOY 4 News.